Hey everyone, it's your favorite coach, Coach and Kim, back with another video. Um, today's video, I kind of wanted to focus on some offensive drills that I run with my athletes to kind of help with defensive pressure or full court press. In girls basketball, they do a lot of pressing. And so I kind of run some simple, basic drills to just get my, my girls comfortable, you know, being able to face the defense, being able to read the defense, and just having the proper footwork. So let's get started. All right, so our first drill is catch, pivot, and face. Um, this is a simple fundamental drill that is definitely needed, especially in girls basketball, but basketball period. Um, you have to be able to catch the ball, pivot, and face, and be able to read the defense. A lot of times girls catch and go, and then they get stuck because they have no idea where the defense is. So first dribble, excuse me, first drill, catch, pivot, face, and rip. Defensive pressure or full court press is applied to speed up the offense so that they can create turnovers. So the key to breaking full court press or defensive pressure is to slow the offense down, create space, and have the ability to read the defense. It's very important. Remember those three things. Slow down the offense, create space, and read the defense. Our second drill is catch, pivot, face with the dribble. It's very important in the game of basketball, especially when there's full court press, that you turn, face, have the ability to read the defense, see what the defense is giving you, whether they're pressing, trapping, or just applying that defensive pressure. And you wanna do that before establishing your dribble. So you know whether you need to pass or you can kind of dribble through the defense. My final drill for today is catch, pivot, face, high rip, low rip, dribble. It's very important. I have a lot of athletes that come to me and when that defensive pressure gets on them, they don't know how to create the space to either pass the basketball or to be able to dribble. And so this drill is very important. It kind of helps you to learn how to create that space, throw those elbows out, um, and you know, be able to get up the court. This ends my video for today. Please practice, practice, practice these drills. Um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. If you have any suggestions or you want me to show you any videos, please put a comment below. Thank you, y'all. I appreciate you. Till next time, keep balling.